that's not all the Aggie football team did this weekend. Friday, the Ags traded their football cleats for gardening gloves. Aggie Sports Overtime reporter Tashara Parker takes a look at how the 12th man rallied and served the community as part of Texas A&M's big event. All right, that'll work out right there. That's good. On a Friday afternoon in March, the Aggie football team would normally be in spring practice, but not today. Instead, they supported a cause even bigger than football, so it didn't take long for organizer Ron Crozier to lay out their duties. We're going to power wash the sidewalks, cleaning out those flower beds, basically, and trimming the uh, bushes and rose bushes. From wiping down windows to pulling weeds, the team put in some hard labor at Twin City Mission, a local homeless shelter in Bryan, Texas. I think it's just a good opportunity to give back to the community. Um, you know, the 12th man, they play such a big role in us, and they're there every weekend for us. They always stand behind us through the dark times and through the good times, you know, and uh, it's just a good opportunity to come back and show our appreciation to them. And showing appreciation is exactly what the Texas A&M University Big Event is all about. More than 22,000 students volunteered for nearly 2,500 service projects in the Bryan College Station area. Uh, it's a big deal, you know, we, we have a scrimmage tomorrow. The big event is, is a, a huge tradition and a great way for all of our students to be a part of the community and, 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 and a great tradition. For many, the service event was about more than just cleaning sidewalks and throwing away trash. Humble yourself and come out in the community for the big event, you know, not make it seem like football is too big for football is too big to get out and help other people. And one of the things we, we try to tell these football players is when you got on that bus to come over here today, you did so as a football player. When you got here, you did so as an Aggie. That's what the big event is. And for all the hard work the players have put in over the years, Twin City Mission had a surprise of their own. This for Polo. And again, you guys made this happen. Twin City Mission unveiled two plaques in memory of a pair of Aggie football players that died in recent years in separate car crashes. And they may not know all the components of who we are, but they know what we do. And that's what's if it's important to them, it's going to be important to us. We enjoy helping them out, and uh, you know it's just a it's a good uh, good opportunity for us to come back and help them out. And Michael says that commitment to service is what the Aggie way of life is all about, both on and off the field. Tashara Parker, Aggie Sports Overtime. The big event is now in its 33rd year, and players say as long as Twin City Mission will allow them to help, they will continue to participate.